What is going on guys? In today's video, I'll be showing you simple methods to boost your FPS in Valorant and also fix any lags that you get in Valorant. Now these settings will be taking your FPS from this and basically take your FPS all the way to this. And you definitely want to make sure you watch until the end of this video to get the best results. So let's not waste no time and get into this video. Now what you want to do for the first step is you want to put Valorant on high performance. So to do that, you want to right click on your desktop, then you want to head over to display settings, then you want to scroll all the way down and you want to click on graphic settings. Then once you open up the graphic settings, you want to head over to browse. Then you want to head over to your local disk. Then you want to find Riot Games. You want to click on Riot Games. You want to head over to Valorant Live. And you want to click on Valorant.exe. And you want to click on Add. Then once you added your Valorant, you want to click on it. And you want to head over to Options. And you want to put it on High Performance and click on Save. Now for the second step, you're going to tweak with some Windows Performance Options. So to do that, what you want to do is you want to head over to your Windows tab. You want to click on Settings. Then you want to head over to System. Then you want to scroll all the way down to About. Then once you head over to About, you want to scroll all the way down and you want to head over to advanced system settings and you want to click on that then you want to head over to the performance tab just here and you want to click on settings then once you open up your performance options what you want to do is you want to untick as many boxes as you can and this will basically give you the best performance option then once you're done with that what you want to do is you want to click on apply and okay now for the third step you're going to tweak with the game user settings so to do that what you want to do is you want to head over to your windows bar you want to type out run then you want to head over and you want to run the run application then once you open up the run application you want to type out this command percentage local update the percentage slash valid i will leave this command in the description so you can copy and paste it then once you pasted this command you want to click on ok then you want to head over to saved config you want to click on this bunch of numbers now these bunch of numbers are profiles so if you have a lot of these that's basically indicating you have a lot of profiles so i'll normally go with the top one then you want to head over back to windows then you want to right click on game user settings and you want to click on edit now once you opened up the game user settings what you want to do is you want to head over to be use vsync and you want to put it on false then once you're done with that, you want to scroll all the way down and you want to head over to scalability groups. Then you want to put your view distance, you want to put that on zero, you want to put your anti-analysing quality on zero. You basically want to put all these three, all of these settings you want to put on zero. Then once you're done putting these settings on zero, you want to click on file and then you want to click on save. Now for the fourth step that might be causing your FPS to drop is your NVIDIA drivers. Now what I would suggest doing is update your NVIDIA drivers. So to update your NVIDIA drivers, all you need to do is head over to your Windows tab. Then you want to head over to NVIDIA Corporation. Then you want to click on GeForce Experience. If you don't have this application, you simply want to download this application. Then what you want to do is you want to click on the Drivers tab. Then you will be able to see if you're on the latest NVIDIA drivers. If you're not on the latest NVIDIA drivers, you simply want to download and update your drivers. Now for the final step, you're basically going to tweak with the in-game settings. So go ahead and launch your game. Then once you open up your Valiant, you want to head over to your settings. Then you want to head over to the Video tab. And what you want to do is you want to put your display mode you always want to put that on full screen mode then once you're done with that you want to hit over the graphics quality then you want to put your material quality you want to put that on low texture quality on low detail quality on low ui quality on low you want to turn off your v-sync then you want to put your anti-analysing you want to put that on msaa 4x and so topical filter you want to put on 2x and you want to put all these other settings off since they will drop your fps but anyway those were the latest and the best settings for valorant if you found this video helpful please give it a like or subscribe to the channel for videos just like this anyway i'll see you in the next video i'm out